Bel Air High School Sports Complex is still under construction, but last night it was vandalized after someone fired shots at the building. k 2 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live from Bel Air with why the district says students are actually still safe. <laughs> Yesleta Independent School District Police, along with El Paso Police, responded here to Bel Air High School about 8.30 last night after they were notified that shots had been fired at the new sports complex that you can see here behind me. Now, if you actually take a look over my shoulder, you can see that there are tape on the windows there. That's where the bullet struck. Now, those windows were repaired earlier this morning. Now, a security guard on the campus heard those shots when they were fired. However, by the time he made it over to the sports complex, those responsible were already gone. Now, YSD tells me that eight windows were damaged, some were just scratched, and others shattered, but some were actually penetrated by bullets. Now, some students on campus told me they felt nervous about a building on campus being shot at. However, YSD said no bullets went inside the building, and students and parents shouldn't be scared. And the fact that these were double paned glasses or panes and that only one side of them was shattered is indicative of how safe those panes are. So we're comfortable with how those panes performed when they were actually um, shot at. The sports complex is expected to be completed this December and in use by January. YASD says this won't set back construction. Baines Contractors is the one that is building this sports complex at this time. Now, they tell me that they still don't have an estimated cost for the damage that was done by these shots. Reporting live at Bel Air High School, Shelby Cap, KTSM 9 News. All right, thank you, Shelby.